gonna give my subscribers a special discount code. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Happy Fashion Friday. I am here today with a day in the life and I wanted to do a fall edition one because fall is my favorite season. I know I've been saying that lots, but it truly is. I've been going fully glam on the makeup and getting like into fall outfits and finally have my beanie on today, which this is the first time I've worn it since last year. So really excited about that. And let me know what your favorite season is. Are you a spring, summer or winter or fall? type of gal and I would say fall 100% and I had so much fun filming this it was actually a great day I feel like I got a lot done I had some fun with the girls you'll see them in today's video as well and I got lots of like organizing done and a little bit of everything as always I like doing that in my vlogs also talked a little bit about my new launch coming next week so cannot wait so excited next Friday Marble Glam will be here so I can't wait to talk about that but I hope you guys enjoy today's video of course if you have any recommendations leave them down in the comments leave some love and if you have not yet subscribed subscribe now join the fam and let's roll right in good morning can you say thank you very much just changed your diaper didn't i can you say good morning morning wow mommy's little helper today thank you so much thank you mia can you say morning morning you're just saying it. Thank you, honey. That's mommy's too. You want to hold it? Okay, morning. Morning. <laughs> morning. There we go. Morning. So they usually do this for a minute. Mommy's going to make you guys breakfast, make coffee, make her own breakfast. Because we're hungry. And you want a pony? You can put a little pony in your hair. Yes? Would you like one? Okay, so I've got strawberries. There's some pineapple. We're gonna do toast with peanut butter And I've got baby shark on because the girls are obsessed. I think that was your Auntie Rhoda <laughs> You guys were dancing a storm when she was here and um, I tried to do a pony, but they took it out But I'm gonna try again after and then I want to show you this new cereal. I got it's like a fall cereal It looks really good mommy's favorites strawberry what did daddy teach you? <laughs> one more? You want to watch one more? That is so cute. Sophia, one more? <laughs> the finger. And there was like a little windstorm yesterday. All our furniture is everywhere outside, isn't it? One more, it is playing, honey. And we're gonna do some cinnamon toast because the girls love cinnamon toast. And I'm sorry, I had to show you these. I had some yesterday. I was craving mini donuts so badly I saw these and it just reminded me of like p and &E in, or Playland in Vancouver when I used to go when I was a kid and Ryan and I had a few. So, a little dangerous but really yummy. All right, we've got one breakfast and two breakfast. Look at your little ponies. I wonder if the fam can tell who's who. Who's this? Comment down below. <laughs> who is this? Can you say one more? <laughs> one more. Yum yum. Let's see what you grab first. Sister had strawberry. What are you grabbing? I think you grabbed a pineapple. Mmm. And strawberry. The other thing I want to show you guys, I'm going to make coffee quickly, but I went to Nordstrom Rack and I got so many things. I was shocked that there was one out here and I went crazy. Like I got a lot, a lot of stuff. This is actually our favorite store. I used to buy stuff for Ryan and I all the time, um, but the actual store had so much great things and I needed fall booties so i actually had these when i last lived out here in uh, calgary so the sorel ones and i liked these a lot they're really warm and waterproof so i got those but i'll show you everything else after i make a coffee and make breakfast and i got the lights on in the kitchen girls are eating okay so this is the cereal i was talking about which i think it's limited edition pumpkin spice cheerios real pumpkin looks so good so fall so i just wanted to quickly show you since I know there's a lot of pumpkin spice lovers out there for fall. Uh, 
Hi, Maxi Baba. <laughs> okay, I had to get this on video. So out of all the shoes you could have grabbed, Miss Mia, you decide the Lubus are the best ones for you. Mommy's most expensive pair. <laughs> you are hilarious. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. And you got some stuff to put away here. Thought you could help me while Sophia and Daddy clean downstairs. Okay. More shoes? No. <laughs> wow, you're gonna have mommy size feet soon. Mommy's got small feet. I think you guys are gonna have bigger feet. <laughs> Half my shoe already. Half my shoe. Wow. Wow, monkey. Okay, so basically I've got lots of stuff, lots of clothes that I haven't put away from like a few weeks ago. Oh, I forgot I got you guys sweatpants. <gasps> look how comfy these look. Oh, I love these. They're so soft. What brand is this? Tucker Tate. I got these at Nordstrom. And oh, back to the Lupos. <laughs> this is the funniest thing. Mia, you're going to be a really expensive shoe lover, aren't you? And those are mommy's only expensive shoes, because you know she's a, a bad girl. My goodness. Um, so yeah, these are really cute. I got them some dresses as well, which uh, unfortunately they didn't wear for their birthday. I just had them in the white ones. I was going to switch their outfits around, but didn't end up doing it. What else do I have in here? Ooh, look Mia, some sockies. Your favorite. You guys love wearing socks. These are really warm. $7.99 H&M. And also, we might be going to a market with Tina and Ben and Michael. Are we going to go with Cousin Michael? Yeah, so... <laughs> she's playing dress up right now. This is so funny. Um, Mia, you already have pants on, my love. This is the everyday goofiness I get. Mommy is so lucky to get your everyday goofiness with your sister. <laughs> I could seriously watch her all, you guys, I could watch these two all day. It's so funny, especially when they're together, which we don't, on, a lot of people ask, do we have separate time with them? It really depends, like if we're trying to clean and stuff like that, but we usually have them play together. I feel like they get their most energy out, but I would like to start doing like little day trips where we each spend time with uh, each of them, so. But you guys love being together. Anytime I take you away from Sophia, you get sad. <laughs> It's actually really really cute. It must be an identical twin thing, but she seriously gets sad She'll start like crying if she notices her sister's not there. I give it a half an hour and then she'll get sad, right? So I'm going in between doing IG stories because I wasn't on there yesterday I had a really busy work day working on my marble lunch for next week Which I will talk about a little bit after but quickly wanted to show you guys my favorite socks getting the girls and they are the H&M ones I also want to place a haul at Zara. That's been my favorite for their outfits But these socks are really nice and thick so I do like them and they come in a nice little set too So I usually get two and like I said socks go missing in our house so easily even my socks and yeah, the other thing Mia's actually wanting to put them on are these shoes that I got them uh, for their birthday, but they didn't end up wearing them, but they still will fit for a little bit longer. So I definitely will have them in them, maybe for some photos. And I wanna keep them in their closets because they're so cute. And I was just playing around with my new launch. I actually don't like when I have more than one item launching like I didn't want to launch this with marble glam just because I really want to concentrate on one thing uh, So marble glam will launch then my makeup case then two other collections of brushes, which I am so excited for I cannot wait my mom's messaging me um, <laughs> On my stories probably of the girls um, But I cannot wait to share with you what I have planned I have something huge planned for Black Friday. That's going to be like a limited edition exclusive um, item so just so much, I'm so excited. In here, I have to organize. I think I'll do it when the girls are down, but I have all my jewelry mixed in with my hair stuff as well. <laughs> I know, honey, you're like a little mama. And then Sophia likes playing with dirt like Dada. I know. Um, okay, so yeah, lots of jewelry to organize in here, which I think I'll do a little bit later. I wanna designate this to have its own drawer because I have so many wigs. Okay, Mia wants to close it. There we go, no problem, honey. And I don't know what's in here. Oh my goodness, I forgot I had this one. Look at this, baby. Mommy has to organize that. I can't believe I still haven't, actually. You know what I was going to use this for? Is the little Pandora charms. I thought that would be nice. So I got this off Amazon. It's pink and gray, which is really pretty. I have all my watches down there. And yeah, the jewelry area I definitely have not finished. 
I think my love is missing sister. Do you want to go see Sissy? You know what mommy's going to do? She's going to organize her skincare. Ooh. Can you say one more? Yeah, one more. All right, we just got the girls downstairs. This is when Ryan is going to kind of help out. And um, he even sometimes cleans the basement when they're downstairs and just like preoccupied. Made a bagel with some of the laughing cow, which is my favorite. I will show you guys really quickly. I went grocery shopping yesterday actually, so I got lots of stuff. Um, but this one, the original laughing cow, these are so good. Uh, and quickly, I just wanted to show you guys, we got lots of fruits and vegetables. I love getting strawberries, grapes, these little things for them to have. Um, y little yogurt drinks, mommy's little yogurt drinks, the activities. And then we have lots of leftover foods. We have steak, pasta, greens, asparagus, yam, tomatoes, lots of celery. I love having celery, carrots, um, the little cheeses, which are really good. We love those. Uh, also lettuce, eggs, peanut butter, just all the stuff, the regulars. So yeah, just thought I would quickly show you guys that. And mommy is going to finally have a little bite of breakfast. I also poured myself a glass of water. I like to drink a lot of water in the morning and just like stay hydrated. Um, and I'm just finishing up my coffee right now too. So I am all done and I wanted to quickly show you how much more amazing this little spa rack is for me. Uh, the other one definitely is going bye-bye. It was shredded into just like little pieces. So I'm definitely happy with this one over the spinning one because I think if you put a little bit of weight on it, like it, it's just not gonna hold. And I didn't have that much weight on it either, but I guess some of the heavier bottles, but this is fantastic. I love how it's displayed. I love how it looks. I put all of my smaller creams up here that would fit. And then most of these are just like my bronzing products. I have a lot of my serums and just things that I reach for all the time. So some of my Tatcha right in the front. I use Tatcha so much. I love their product line and I just have some brushes and stuff over here, but yeah, it's quite organized and just, I just love the overall look of this. And then I do have some other products that were just a little bit smaller. So I'm gonna make like a little, um, maybe just like a little thing to put in here. Got my marble brushes. And then yeah, this should just fit like in an, into a little container. Maybe if I take out the candles, I do like displaying can candles. It just is a lot nicer to have those in my washroom. Um, and then I can use this for just like some of the smaller little items that I try and uh, these are mostly from like Ipsy and just little product samples that I get so mm -hmm. yeah it's good okay so I am all done I love how my skincare looks now it's just so organized and then I did put some of the stuff in here too like smaller items I had down in this drawer I just have a few things that I added into my skincare drawer so that's what it looks like Okay, so we are doing laundry right now. The girls are still napping. I thought I would show you what I got from Nordstrom Rack because I left so, so happy. And I've actually never shopped at the actual store. We've just done a lot of shopping online, uh, but Ryan also loves clothes there. So I got him some clothes. I think he's washing it right now, but I found these Uggs. They were half off. They are so cute and warm and fuzzy. I do have my other Uggs that I wear every day, but I feel like the insides are kind of worn out. So I did want to get these ones. I feel like they're really fall and they're they're just beautiful to look at. So they look super comfortable. I got, okay, I actually have to show you these. I remember 
the lady at the till was like, oh my God, $25. Like she was freaking out. So uh, these I got for 25 bucks, which is crazy. So they were like major on sale. I think they were like 80% off. Um, really beautiful wedge. Obviously I love wedges, so I'm not gonna wear them during the fall. It's a little too cold, but for next summer, I think they'll look so pretty and it's kind of like a sparkly silver. And I just find they're really comfortable to wear. And I don't like wearing heels that often, but just for like fancier, dressier occasions. But I'll wear wedges all the time because these are easy to wear for me. So I got those. These I got. Now, I don't actually have, besides those two pairs right there, like a nude shoe that is like kind of strapless. So I just thought these were kind of nice. And these were $50. And yeah, Rachel Zoe. I actually got her beauty box before, so I didn't even know she had a shoe line. It's really cool though, but um, yeah, I'm gonna put them up on my little shoe rack thereafter. So that was those. And then these, I actually, funny story, I had these when I lived here before. So these are the best like snow boots I find and they just kept me so warm all winter. So I wanted to get a pair and I got Ryan a pair too. His are black, so they're downstairs. They're a bit shorter as well, but really, really nice for winter here because it's gonna get really cold. Okay, I love this top. Okay, so I'm just gonna put it on a hanger. It's a little bit easier for you guys to see. This was $46, a little bit pricier, but I've wanted like a really nice blouse so I feel like this will look great with jeans and then like some heels or wedges or something like that or boots even boots would look really nice for fall so I feel like I can get or get to wear it like right now and then also it's almost like a spring shirt too so I love when you buy something and you can wear it for more than like one season so I got that I got the girls matching sweaters so right here they have like a little palm at the top which I thought was really cute and uh, yeah they just looked really comfy I love like wool sweaters on them they have one already but not in this color it's a little bit darker so these were $27 which I really do like these they're quite nice and then I got a very comfy I don't know if I should wear this like as a PJ shirt. It's just kind of got that material like a PJ shirt. It's like super soft. Either that or just like an around the house. I don't think I'd wear this out. I did get it in like the like the lingerie section. So um, it definitely is, I think, more of a pajama shirt, but it's cute. I mean, I would wear it with jeans and it's so soft. Next top I got, this is a brand called Naked Zebra. Haven't heard of it before, but I just thought this would be really nice. And then you could tuck it into some jeans, wear some boots. And like I said, I feel like I'm just super into blouses right now and I don't have that many. So I got that as well, which I just think is really nice and simple. And then I just got this like long nighty. So I feel like PJs, I've had like one or two outfits here and I've just been wanting to get some more. So this was $20 on sale and it just looked really comfortable. So I have that and I do have like a, uh, a robe as well. So I thought I could wear this with a robe during the fall. And then, okay, so I think I left a few of these downstairs. I was really excited to find these because we've needed bigger containers for leftovers. We're huge leftover uh, people right now because we've been cooking at home a lot. So they had all of these, which I think are great. This was $10 and I'm not sure how much they are full price, but these are awesome. Like I love the ones that are like this and um, they're glass as well. So you can like warm up your food after, which is great. So I think I got five of these. So I do have some other color ones downstairs to show you. Last but not least, I have Ryan's shirt up here still in the bag. So I got him just like a simple V-neck. He's very plain with clothes. I was really happy he did like this because I, I sent him a picture of like, like some fancier ones and he was like no no when I was at the store so I usually text him like right away because I hate to buy something and have to return it but I just got him like a really simple um little v-neck with a few buttons there and yeah that was everything I got I feel like I got so many nice things and I just love Nordstrom Rack. Like I love shopping there online too. The only thing is the shipping takes a really, really long time. So I wish it didn't take as long. I wish there was like a shipping option. I would have probably paid more to have it sooner, um, but definitely love that there's one around. Let me know if you want me to do this like regularly and show you stuff that like is at Nordstrom Rack because I love shopping there. And I could probably vlog in there too because it was pretty empty. Okay, so I guess I only got two more. For some reason I thought I got five, but I got three of them. Um, so I got a circular one and then this one, which 
which I think is really nice because you can separate your food a lot easier. So these are just so nice. I'm, I'm shocked that they had them there. I would have probably bought more because we're so big on using these and the ones we have now are much smaller. Uh, so we, we actually have, I don't know if I've said, but uh, we have Thanksgiving dinner here this year and we're having our friends come over, the one that I did the mom's video with. So Tina, her husband, and then Michael as well, their son. And then Ryan's brother, Michael, is actually coming here too. So we're gonna be doing like a Thanksgiving dinner here. So I definitely wanna have like lots of Tupperware. Um, I'm sure we're gonna have leftovers like all week long. I'm so huge on stuffing. I like cannot wait, um, but yeah, really excited. I also wanna find some new placemats, you guys. I'm not a fan of these ones. Um, I don't know, I just feel like I need to get something different for the house. So if I can go to HomeSense, hopefully I can get that for like either next week, uh, but we will see. I will let you guys know when I go to HomeSense, but hopefully soon. So so. Yeah, hey, boo. <laughs> Ready to eat? Okay. I'm back with water, pepperoni stick, and I'm gonna finish my makeup now. I was helping Ryan feed the girls, and then we're gonna go to Tina's actually, have a little play date, have dinner there. That'll be nice. So, wanna finish up filming, do some work, take photos with beanies. And then, I wonder, I might not be able to get footage at her house. I was gonna get like footage of the play date and them playing, but I just have a feeling I won't be able to film once I get there and it'll be so busy anyways, but, whew. Just finishing up with a little bit of blush and then I will go back to my closet and I actually wanted to organize my jewelry. That's actually been something I've been wanting to do for like a month. <laughs> And I want to just get everything all clean so I can actually do a jewelry collection video soon for you guys. But I'm going to finish getting ready and then I'll come back on. Okay, so I've got all three of my organizers right here. So I think what I'm going to do is put like my smaller pieces in here. Because this is my favorite one right now. And I think I want to get the other ones in the pink that kind of look like this for bracelets and stuff. But I thought I could do like smaller pieces like earrings and such and put them in here for now. I think that'll kind of look nice, like the little studs and stuff. And I'm just such a big jewelry person and it's funny because I don't wear a lot. I wear typically like, you know, my LV hoops and stuff like that, but I love having jewelry and like collecting it. And I just think it's so pretty to look at. So I've always been a huge jewelry fan. Put some studs in there, Can put some rings in here. And I'll link this down below as well. I think this is fantastic to use for like studs and stuff. So if you have a lot of studs um, or Pandora charms, which I can't even find my Pandora bracelet right now, but I will try later. Oh, I've got my Mia Sophia bracelet as well right there. So. So that's what it looks like right there. I definitely like this organizer a lot. And once I find my Pandora charms, which I do have a lot, I can put like all the individual ones in there. So I think that looks really nice. I did keep, my goodness, I'm out of breath. <laughs> uh, I did keep my bracelets in this section here. And then this one, I kind of have like, I don't know, miscellaneous bracelets, necklaces, some um, Olive and Piper bracelets and stuff. Uh, so yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is get two more of these, but uh in you know the different ones for the bracelets and the necklaces and then and then do a jewelry collection but i just like having these and then i'm just about to take some photos with my beanie on so i will show you but i have my leg warmers in here all ready for fall and then headbands in here you know i love headbands uh just to wear with my wigs and then also all my beanies so my friends did say that wolf fan collective did restock all of their beanies so definitely check them out i'm wearing the pink one right now which matches this one i think i can't find the other one i must have put it somewhere but um i this is my favorite one i love matching the girls but I think I'll have them in these ones, which is the white and the pink. 
these really cute ones right here, but um, I'm just obsessed. I could live in beanies all day long. <laughs> The other thing I forgot to show you, I was up late last night designing the new book, Chat Books, and no, this is not sponsored, uh, but these are the books that I made for the girls. This was the Christmas one, and then we have the la last year fall edition, so I actually wanna do another fall book. This was like with all the pumpkins and everything. I just made one though for their birthday, and I can't wait for you guys to see it. So it was all the shots we had from their second birthday, the Enchanted Forest theme, and I also made um, some other stuff, which I'll just share once I get it all in, but I cannot wait. We're gonna go to the pumpkin patch soon and get some new photos of the girls. Look at that, Halloween. I don't even know what they're gonna be this year. They were Belle last year, but these are so fun and they're actually, I compared the pricing. So with Google Photos, it was more expensive in the end and this was cheaper. So I think my book was around $60 when I finished it, but oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at that last year. I can't believe how big they are. They just grow so fast, but I just wanted to show you those and then you can get two different sizes. I ended up doing for their birthday uh, this size book, but I did it in the hard copy, like their, um, their most expensive paper. So it's kind of like a harder style, but you can always get these, these ones as well. So cute. And the other thing I wanted to mention before I go here, and we're gonna be going to my friend Tina, so make sure you guys are following along on Insta stories because whenever I'm doing stuff, I always feel like I'm on there the most, but the Marble Glam brushes, stay tuned because next week when I upload, I'm gonna give my subscribers a special discount code. You know I'm huge on discounts and savings in my shop, so I definitely wanna make sure you guys get some savings with these new brushes, but I love them so much. They turned out so beautiful, and I, I've had them in my bathroom, you already know since we moved here. They really were inspired by our new home, uh, and I just am so, beyond blown away with how they turned out the coloring and they really are just so gorgeous like year-round color just to have in your home for that extra sparkle and i haven't really done silver before so i really like how they turned out they're just stunning so definitely the softest bristle i've done so far so uh lots of new stuff coming and i'm really excited the other thing which I have not talked about, I've been wearing this all the time. It's the Moisturizing Body Lotion by Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. Little expensive, but I definitely think it makes for nice decor. It also is very moisturizing and you only need a little bit. Like do not use a lot of this because it's quite scented. Uh, but if you don't mind the Chanel scents, then I definitely highly recommend it. It is really nice moisturizing and my skin has been so flaky dry, like it's ridiculous. So I've been using that and I wanna get a bigger dip deep candle. Hopefully Sephora, like maybe their next sale or something, I can get one because they're also expensive, but I think they're really, really pretty. Okay, you guys, so that was my day in the life. I hope you enjoyed it. These are probably one of my favorite videos to film and I just feel like I get a lot or I can share a lot with you guys in these types of videos. So the other video I wanted to do was either a nighttime fall routine or a morning fall routine. Which one do you guys wanna see? Let me know in the comments. I probably will end up doing both, but which one would you guys like to see first? And I hope you've been having a really great fall. I know it's getting a little bit colder here now which is kind of nice i kind of like it getting into boots and like warm cozy sweaters uh i will be planning on going to home sense i know i said that before i really hope it's soon so i can do a fall home decor haul for you and of course if you guys have not yet subscribed subscribe before you leave and definitely check out all my other vlogs if you have missed them and of course i will see you guys on makeup monday